DJ here with the Chief Peak, and today we're gonna to be doing a 20 minute shoulders workout. For the workout, we're gonna go through nine exercises performed in straight sets, and we're gonna do two sets of each exercise. Our working time is 40 seconds, our break time is 20 seconds. In between the different exercises, we'll then take a 30 second extended break. If you like this workout, hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, and let's get to work. All right, so we got about 20 seconds until we get started with our warm up. We're gonna go into arm circles first. So what we're gonna do here, put our arms out by our side and then we're just gonna do some small little circles. Also, I have 20 pound dumbbells and 15 pound dumbbells with me today. So we'll see how the workout goes with these longer or extended working times. Here we go, so arms out. Here we go, nice little circles at first. We're gonna move into some larger circles. Here we go. All right, then we're gonna reverse it. Start moving into some smaller reverse circles. There we go, so now bend those elbows at a 90, hands up, internal, and then external rotation. There's an internal rotation, the shoulders come up, external, keep the elbows nice and high here. We don't want the elbows dropping like that. Only 20 second working times for the warm up. no breaks. So next we're just gonna do some shoulder presses with no weight. So just kind of get a warm up, come up, raise the hands, come back down. Same position like we would be doing with our dumbbells. We would have our elbows in front of the shoulder, pressing up, coming down. Pressing up, coming down. Focus on those shoulders. Next we're just gonna put our hands down. We're gonna do some front raises. So come all the way up, squeeze all the way back down. There we go. Up and back down. Up. Good controlled movements. Here we go. All right, we're gonna get our feet nice and wide. We're just gonna do a side bend with a reach. Stretch out the lats, stretch out the shoulders a little bit. Here we go, the obliques. Nice and easy, nothing crazy here. Just getting warm. After this, we're gonna to go to a trunk twist with a reach. So now we're gonna start rotating the body, the trunk, and the hips. If you want, you can even just start with just the trunk rotating, or you can immediately do a uh, pivot with the hips and feet. So we go after this, we're gonna have about 20 seconds before we go into our workout. All right, we got about 20 seconds until we get started with our workout. Our first exercise we're going into is Arnold's. So we're gonna grab some dumbbells. We're gonna curl them up, have our palms facing towards us. And then as we push up, we're gonna rotate the palms away from us. There we go. So a couple seconds till we get started. Good solid base. Here we go. Coming up, rotate the palms away. Down, rotate the palms towards you. Just like that. Don't forget to breathe. Exhale on the way up, inhale on the way down. Make sure that you're keeping your elbows in front of your shoulders. As you begin to rotate, don't pull your elbows like that. We want them to kind of stay out in front of us and drive up. There we go. Really try to burn those shoulders up today. If you need to take a little break, that's fine. Two, three seconds, five seconds. Try to hop back into the workout as quick as you can go so 20 seconds we're gonna go back in to Arnold's ten seconds here we go let's curl them back up here we go pushing up coming down pushing up coming down Good control movements here. Starting to get a nice little burn in the shoulders. Keep pushing. If you need to, you can drop down with those legs, explode up, and then control it down. Drop down with the legs, explode up, use momentum to get those dumbbells up in the air. Let's get one more rep. Here we go. All right, we got a little extended break here, and then we're gonna go in to shoulder press. So for shoulder press, 
We're gonna have our palms facing away from us the entire time, pushing up, coming back down. Again, elbows stay in front of the shoulders at all times. Grab some water if you need it. Got about five seconds until we get started here. Here we go, bring them up, palms facing away, coming up and down, up and down. There we go, good controlled reps. If it starts to get too tough, drop down with the legs. You can explode up. Another option is to just alternate arms left and right. That's totally fine to do as well. Remember, trying to keep the elbows in front of the shoulders right here as we're pressing up. We don't want to start pressing up and go like that. Let's go. Let's get two more. One more. There we go. Good reps right there. Woo! Already feeling it. Here we go. 10 seconds till we get started. Five seconds. Gotta wait till the last second to grab them. <laughs> Here we go. Bring them up. Coming up. And down. Up. And down. Good controlled movement. Let's go. Come on. Keep pushing. 20 seconds. Let's go. Push it out. Let's go. We got one more. Woo! Here we go. All right, 30 second break. Next, we're going to go in to C raises. My shoulders are on fire. Alright, so lighter weight here. What we're going to do is start with our palms out, circle all the way up, come back down. Just like that. Five seconds till we get started. Here we go. Coming up and up. Let's go. And down. Come on, push it out. Keep pushing. Gotta embrace that burn. Here we go. Come on. Let's get one more. Here we go. Way to push it. Not gonna lie, I didn't expect that one to burn so bad. <laughs> Here we go, five seconds, going back into it. Just gotta keep pushing. Here we go. Open up and down. Let's go. If it does start to get too heavy, you could always just alternate arms, coming up, back down. Here we go. Come on. Push it out. One more. Let's go. There we go. Woo! Way to push it. All right, next, we're going to go into bent over reverse flies here. So, still nice light weight. What we're doing here, bending at the hips and knees, slight bend in the elbows right here, palms facing back, coming up, back down. Notice how I maintain the same bend in my elbows at all times. All right, so from the side. Just like that, and then out, squeeze. As you come up, squeeze those rear delts. There we go. If this is too heavy, then you can just do singles. If it's still too heavy, 
What you can do is more of a high row, keeping that dumbbell nice and high, not down here, way up here. And that's gonna help still activate that rear delt, just like that. So putting the options there, because this one's gonna be tough. Now, let's go. One more. There we go. Going to set two here. Keep pushing. All right, a couple seconds. We got about five seconds till we go back into it. Let's grab them. There you go. Don't forget to breathe. Here we go. Let's go. Burn those rear delts up. If you need to, you can alternate. Just try to keep going. Whatever you gotta do to keep pushing. Let's go. Come on. There we go. Woo, good stuff. All right, 30 second break. We're gonna go in to lateral raises. So for these ones, what we're gonna do is start with the weight right out in front of us, and then we're gonna come out to the side, back down. When you're doing these, make sure that when you're out here, you have your thumb slightly higher to the pinky, or than the pinky, so you don't kind of uh, get that shoulder impingement going on. Here we go. So, slide bending the elbows, coming up, back down, up, back down. Another option here, start with your hands at a 90, or elbows at a 90, come out, back down, keeping the elbows at a 90 the entire time. There we go. Come on. Push it out. One more. Ah, there we go. Woo. Shoulders are burning. Going back into it here. Five seconds. Let's go. Come on, we gotta keep pushing. Here we go. Coming out and down. When you come out, squeeze those shoulders. Here we go. Try not to get too much trap involved. A lot of times what happens when it starts to get too heavy, you're going to get like a shrug. We don't want to do a shrug here. Focusing on the shoulders. There you go. Come on. Ten seconds. Woo! Let's go. There we go. All right, 30 second break. And then, where are we going into front raises here? So with the front raises, what we can do is actually increase the resistance and then we're gonna alternate hands. So we'll do left, right, left, right, come up, back down. If you want, when you come up, you can point your uh, palm down or you can have your palm pointing to the side. Either one's totally fine. Here we go. So alternating front raises right here. There we go. Good controlled movements. Notice how I'm not sitting here doing this. We're not rocking. That's not gonna help us grow our shoulders. Smooth, controlled movements. If it does get too heavy and you can't perform a quality rep, you could kind of cheat it, kind of get a little bit of that rock and then slowly lower it, focus on that negative. You could do that, but that's last resort. Come on. Let's go, one more. There you go. 20 seconds going back into it. There we go. 10 seconds. 
Here we go, going back into alternating front raises. Here we go, coming up and down. Up and down. Remember, as you come up, you can also rotate that palm down. That's fine. Either one. Let's go. Focus on good controlled movements. Let's go. Ten seconds. Come on. Last one. There we go. All right, 30 second break. We're going to go to linear jammers. So we're going to go linear jammer left, linear jammer right, take our extended break, and then do it for a second time. So grab a dumbbell here, get a nice little split stance going on. Hand in the dumbbell is the side that's towards the back foot right here. Push up, come back down. Here we go. Let's get ready. Here we go. Pushing up, coming down. Pushing up, coming down. The nice thing about the jammers, you can bust out some fast reps. Also, you can use those legs to drive up, hold it up right there. Boom, boom, there you go. Come on. I like to use the linear jammers for our burnout. Really push it, especially since you're only using one dumbbell. Come on, gauge that core. Uh, let's go. Ooh. Ooh. Uh, we got one more. Uh, there we go. All right, we're switching sides here. Ooh. Ten seconds. Linear jammer right side. Here we go. All right, let's get that hand up. Come on. Pushing up. Down, up, down. Try not to use the legs until you absolutely have to. Come on. Let's go. Keep pushing. Ten seconds. <laughs> there we go. Nah, ah, one more. Ah, woo. Oh, guys, okay, extended break. We're going back into the left side. Here we go. We're almost finished. We got linear jammers again, left side, right side, and then one more exercise. Come on, here we go. Well, I think we got about 10 more seconds. Here we go, let's get ready. Five seconds, linear jammers, left side. Come on. Boom. Push it out. Come on. Keep pushing, don't give up. Halfway. Oh, you got it. Let's go. Come on. Oh. Left side smoked. There we go. Right side. Come on. Let's go. See what you can do here. Here we go, hand up. Let's go. Come on, push it out. Come on, oh, 20 seconds, let's go. Use those legs if you have to. Shoulders on fire. Keep 
Keep pushing. Come on. One more. Ah. Woo. Ah. I don't want to move on them last couple reps. My 30 second break. Then we're going into cheat lateral raises. So we're going to cheat here. You don't need a super heavy weight though. So what we're going to do is we're going to go back into our lateral raises. If it's too heavy, then what you're going to do is kind of force it up and then slowly lower. Force it up, slowly lower. So we're going to utilize momentum on that contraction, getting it up there. So pull it up, slowly lower. Nice and slow here. So cheat it up and then try to resist it going down. Try to get around that four second negative. So try to take four seconds to lower it down. Come up. Here we go. Come on. <laughs> Let's go. If you need to, you can alternate. Last one. There we go. All right, one more. Chi lateral raises. We're finished. Hmm. Same thing here. If you need to alternate, you just do one, four second down, lift the other, four second down. Do that. Just don't give up. Keep trying to push. Here we go. Let's get our dumbbells up. Cheat them up. Slowly lower. Cheat them up. Come on. Let's go. Woo. Can barely hold it up there. Come on. All right, last one. Come on. Hold, hold, hold. Woo. There we go. Way to go. Way to push it today. My shoulders are on fire. <laughs> I hope your shoulders are burning too. All right, if you like that workout, be sure to smash that like button, subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you on the next one. See you guys.